I just made a video, but it turns out I wasn't recording. Oh well. It's fine. I got to see stuff. I was saying how epic this hike is and how big some of these trees are. These, I think, are the coastal redwoods. They're smaller, but they're very tall. Compared to like the sequoias, which are, you know, the ones that they used to dig holes to drive a car through. for scale. <laughs> uh, so beautiful. Wish you could see it. We're climbing. We got some switchbacks here. I haven't put the phone away. I've climbed a fair bit. Oh, maybe you can see. I was, I was down at, I don't know, sea level. Holy sh... Y'all, y'all. Tired, tired, so many switchbacks. And today I learned that everybody knows what switchbacks are. <laughs> Which is so funny to me, living in hilly area like I do. 
There's so many switchbacks on our roads, let alone when hiking. Also, never, never think to yourself that there can't possibly be much more climbing. Because the hill can always be taller than it looks. <laughs> I gotta remember to look this up. I don't know if this is chaparral, something else. I gotta get a book that tells me. This tree has awesome hair. I think I'm doing a loop trail of sorts. Put another way, I sure as hell hope I'm doing a loop trail of sorts. You can see the bridge over. Where is my finger? Over there. Pretty flowers. Don't touch anything though. It could be poison oak. You can see the prison from here. Right there. San Quentin. Right now, we're hoping that I'm headed the right way. <laughs> and looking at that view. These people in front of me, I'll let them pass me. They have one of those dogs that kind of looks like an Ewok in a backpack. You know what I'm talking about. I'm on a fire route now. So this will be steep, but probably fewer routes to climb over. almost missed my turning. Ooh, worst kind of bike. It's 
steep downhill. At least there's no rocks to act like bearings. Oh, there's some people coming. drive here was amazing. So we're going to see if we can capture it. Knowing that I may have to drop my phone so that I can, you know, drive. Also, I guess I'm hoping that I remember how to get where I'm going. It's not have navigation on. It's fine. This is fine. So. Um, basically, I want to buy a house here. And good news, there's one for sale. Coming soon. I suspect it's going to be like $5 million. Because... Y'all, this place is like epic. That guy's on the road. Um, probably I go this way. Cause why not? I remember there being a tree in the road like that. I remember driving in the middle of the road. Like, that bee needs to put her phone down. You're not wrong, guy. But I'm also going 15 miles an hour. Driving safe. Looking at trees. This tree decided it lives here, not the road. Those trees also decided that their home is there. And the road can go to hell. Don't blame them. Wish I could do that to roads. Can you imagine if this was the street you lived on? Probably would get old. Gosh, I hope it wouldn't get old. I hope if you lived on this street, you would, 
you would daily be impressed with its majesty. Like, look if that was your house and you're like, oh, no big deal. I just have two million foot tall trees in my yard. That guy's probably far from the curb. Shame, shame. <sighs> I tell you what, my arm is getting a workout from holding up the phone. I'm gonna put this down now. I hope you've enjoyed. This is a blind curve. Bye.